They've got to find some way to get people to watch CNN. Oh, come on. Even at the airport, who's desperate enough to... Shh. Guys, my favorite reporter's on. With his student debt relief plan, the president is personally forgiving your student loans. Up to $10,000. I can't believe this. Oh, boy. Brilliant! Hey, it's what Bubble Man would have wanted. That's why I'm upset. Ron, almost all of this debt exists because the government was pushing loans to begin with. According to the National Bureau of Economic Research, subsidized loans mean more expensive college tuition. And this is just another subsidy that's going to cause the cost of tuition to inflate. It will literally only make things worse. You should be happy for me, and for everyone else who's taken out a student loan they'll never repay. Ron, I paid my loans off the hard way. Why do I gotta pay yours off the hard way too? That's like someone surviving cancer and then being upset that a cure is found for people who are just diagnosed, you ghoul. Dude, you chose to take out loans. You don't choose to get cancer. Yeah, it's more like someone who's never had cancer being given cancer by someone who does have it. Ugh, you're giving me cancer just talking about this. What about people who have already paid off more money than they borrowed because of the insane interest rates? That's one group I can sympathize with. These are federally guaranteed loans, so the idea of making insane amounts of interest off of them seems very wrong to me. But that's a separate discussion from the government offering blanket loan forgiveness to everyone, even people who have barely paid in at all. But this is gonna help so many people who are struggling. Just think of all those poor PhDs flipping burgers. I wish I had an active enough imagination. PhDs have a 1.1% unemployment rate. And considering their average salary is over $90,000 a year, I think it's safe to say that the 98.9% .9 who are employed aren't flipping burgers. In fact, roughly 50% of college debt is owed by people with a master's degree or higher, meaning that on average they make twice as much as people with no college education, and their unemployment rate is three times lower. And you think they shouldn't have to pay for that privilege? For the fact that they got to spend six years out of the workforce just to step out into the world with a massive economic advantage despite never having contributed any good or service before? Even worse, you think people without a degree who make half the amount are the ones who should cover the cost. You don't need a break on your loans, we need a break from you! Uh, attention flyers, the Bubble Man Memorial Airline Flight 675 back to Florida has been delayed. Yeah, oh, looks like we're gonna be here a while. I could use a drink. Which one of you is buying? Thank you so much for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe to the channel. Also, check out the links in the description because we bring the receipts and leave a comment below. We'll see you on the next wonderful, exhilarating episode of Common Sense Soapbox. Check it out.